Welcome back to Own the World Place EU4 uh, in our Castile game right now. Hopefully we will become Spain in due time as we go for the At Every Continent achievement. We have reached two. Lucky us, as we can see here in Age of Discovery. We are present on two continents. This is probably the next one we'll go for and Control Centers of Trade. We'll see if we get there. Um, hold three thrones if we can get the Iberian Wedding to pop. That would be great. We need them to have a... Carlos, we need a daughter. We may also end up with Die, Please Die. I have not gotten that one either. But let's see, our great power, we've managed to climb back into 7th. And we can check out our institutions. How are we doing over here? 0 0.08, 0 0.06, 0 0.1, 0 0.06, 0 0.08, Queen Consort is dead, 0 0.08, 0 0.05, 0 0.07, 0 0.06. Yeah. European tend de development. We need nearby friendly provinces. For anything that fire. Aragon. You're at war with England. That's probably going very well. Yep, you can come back from Portugal. We'll go back this view. France, yeah, you're curb stomping. England, Denmark, Sweden, and Norway. How, what? What's this about? Scotland and France. Let's check out that war. Danish conquest of Aberdeen. So Denmark, Sweden, Norway. So, Norway thinks part of Scotland should be a part. This is going very interestingly. England is getting wrecked. And we're just going to sit and stay out of the fray. We can just build trade. And we don't get a big bonus from any of that, so we will stay away. The marketplace finished in Tangiers. Those underhanded rogues in Aragon. We'll add Alicante to our list. Yep, we now have a claim there. Morocco, we're still seven years off. We don't really care. I mean, eventually we will. We'll try to chew the rest of the coast. How are we doing? Oh, I wish I had a cheaper somebody there. Great. The advisor died. And we go forward. Who should we be friends with next? We can give Pope Man some love again. I mean, we do want to keep them on the list. Venice doesn't like the Ottomans. We're going to lose our great power status again. We can invest, which means we get temples, which is awesome. Which means we get money. Now, we still have to get here, so... It still says we're seven years off. That sucks. Um, but we will add money. Sevilla, 0.23. Salamanca, 0.20. So, something happened. The Navarran peasants. Well, I really don't care. They can peasant all they want in Navarra. So, 
I can gain on raced in Granada, and Catholicism can gain one reform desire. So, I mean, I kind of want it to fire, because that means I can control the Pope. I have a better chance of being in charge. The more heretical we become, and the more they'll give me more cardinals. Yeah, I got passed. So, Navarra, I think we said, what did we say? Fourteen sixty two, the end of fourteen sixty two. We can begin the annexation. And in sixteen years, these two clowns have managed to stay alive. We don't have a queen. But the two guys that we got who aren't very bright just keep on going. Hmm, Navarra, you're hanging out in our capital. So those temples will add income. Um, so... Sevilla. So base tax we get seven. Enrique died. Enrique is dead. We don't have an heir. <laughs> A su succession war between Aragon and France. This could be fun. So Sevilla is now point nine two. Let's come back and check that. Yeah, so eleven ducats. So that's a per month gain. So that's point two. So over the year, that's 2.4 ducats. That pays for itself in about 25 years. But you also start to get other stacking bonuses, yada, yada, yada. I mean, and it keeps that higher. We somehow tipped back into 8th. Ming, Ottomans, France, Poland, Mamluks, Timurids, Muscovy, and us. Okay, we stopped with Burgundy. Well, let's come. Let's spend some time. Morocco. I was going to go to Savoy, but you know what? We may as well do this. Aragon, you and I are just having a fun game of fabricating claims on each other. So Barcelona, Tarragona, and the Boleras. Well, we'll take Tarragona. We'll just kind of work our way up the coast. Yep. Our modifier ended... We are at full manpower. Cultures are a little messy, but actually not too bad. Iberian and North Af Moroccan. Tunis, I'm sure you've met up with the Ottomans. Yep, you met up with the Ottomans already. So we'll just kind of leave you be. Oh, 
we have provincial unrest, not enough that I care. I mean, those are small numbers and it'll continue to tick down. We want to look, let's see how we are doing with our marriages. We have, we're married to everybody, Austria, Navarre, and Portugal. So we lose five sailors a month. Okay. Um. Okay. So. Our king died. We have a succession war going on for us. So we could fall underneath Aragon. Huh? Is that how this is going to work? This is going to be bonkers, I think. We're going to put those as of interest, I guess. Um, we're going to come over here. We'll grant a generalship to a level 40. Well, that was a bad roll, a 1-1-1. One, one, one. Well, at least he's alive. And that's almost all we can say about him, is that, yeah, he's alive. So who's in this? Castile, Corfu, Florence, Naples, Navarra, da-da-da-da-da. Oh, I think we're going to have an interesting development. Yeah. France, how are your boats? You don't have boats. So we are now underneath Aragon. This is just bonkers. This is going to be an interesting run. I've never had this happen. Where I'm the junior partner in insanity. You know, we'll let Aragon hang out there. 20 army tradition. Is that going to do us any good? No, we're going to decline. I don't really need... I mean, if it was to get to like 60, I might. But... We're going to go ahead and let leave it be. They brought in Lorraine and Provence. There's a lot of shenanigans going on right now, and I don't even know what to say. Yeah, France is going to have some issues. Provence got in there. I don't know where Aragon decided to drop troops there. So we'll come gather the Navarans and whatever. Garcia de Lara. So we now control that.
We shattered that French fleet, which is important. So, 252, Charles de Voix, 223. Yeah, they're just cycling them in. I'm going to hit them again. There we go. Garcia de Lara, yes, bring them back to Vizcaya. That's a big win. That's a huge win. So the flip side is we're going to need a way out of this mess. Who have you, you got? Just Venice and Florence. So we'll be able to come then, support our independence, and come back at this mess. Yeah. AI, why did you do what you did? Yeah, the friend, all our rowdy friends are here. Yeah, this is going to be pretty even. Jeez. Whoa! What is that shenanigans? A stack wipe? Wow! France! Wow! I mean, just wow! I mean, wow! Hi, we're hanging out. Yeah, why would you have kept... Oh, never mind. I know what happened. Wow. Yeah, they, er, er, they called everybody in. This is a bizarre war. Their morale is just rock star level. Um, yeah. Well, you guys don't need to be with us. We're going to come down to Granada because we can stay away from lots and lots of bad people here. We'll come to Vizcaya. Oh. Because we've got 19. 20. Twenty-one, twenty-two. What is that? That's twenty-four? Five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Good, Navarra likes us better. What is going on? Navarra, ooh, Navarra, what was that? What was that? What suicide pact are you under? Nobody knows what, what that was about. I mean... 
Yeah, we're going to divide and conquer here. Yeah, you guys, the other half can hang out in Navarra. Aragonia, you got wrecked. Well, well, we've been doing a good job of building up our claims down here. Okay. So. England now likes us. So we want to improve our relationship there. We want to come to Denmark, improve our relationship there. Since we are no longer in this, Aragon is our great and powerful leader. So we've now got to break free from them and flip all of this on them. So the Iberian wedding is now gone. This is insanity. Navarra doesn't know what they're doing. Navarra is just sending one little dude to take care of things. If we can get through, then we can kind of take it to France. You know what we can do? We can grab this group, change your mission. We're going to privateer uh, Venice, Ragusa, da, 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 Bordeaux. Fourteen. I mean, we've got France trapped in... Oh, crap. We can't get there to do anything about that. We're going to roll our numbers. That's what we like to see. We want to see France in our territory. And that's hills, so we can get there and really cause some damage. And bizarrely, I think we're going to get tech. Like, all of them are rolling. Oh, because we've got that awesome guy now. We've won the board. That's important. So now we have a piece of France. No, we would like that. But the bigger piece is we've now taken another route into France. Yeah. Up to Poitou. Any damage? They're just hanging out. Cool. Yeah, they're just going to dump in. Yeah, we'll come this way. Aragon, I really... Okay, so let's check out this military situation. Our war enemies, well, war enemies, there we go. France. France has run out of manpower. That's, I think, the big deal. Um, timer went off a while ago, so we're going to go ahead and end this. Um, in the next episode, we'll see us trying to go exploring and just kind of forgetting about Aragon. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye!